shoot! Uh, hey, 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 hey! Uh, tell me you got a stim pack. I'm hurting here. Oh, thank God. Thank you. Good to know there's still some heart out there. So, uh, you the cavalry then? Duchess send you to save our tails? Much as I appreciate it, I'm not the one who needs helping right now. See, these, uh, scorched things have been harrying the bar. Me and my bot sis Polly got the bright idea to track down their nest and clear them out. But a couple of them got the drop on us before Polly chased them off deeper into the mine. I heard some fighting, but then, uh, nothing. I think she's hurt. Look, you've got to find Polly. I can't be the reason she... Look, just find her. Please. <sighs> thank you, thank you. Once you've got her, just bring her back to the Wayward. I I'll be there. And tell her... Tell her I'm sorry I couldn't be the one to save her. Can use a lift. You are a sight for sore eye. So, those things didn't get you, huh? You happen to see a young man on your way through, early twenties, rough around the edges, carrying about a bullet's worth of extra lead in him. He's alive? Thank God, that's good to hear. So, what do you say you and I help each other out? You get me back to the wayward, and I'll help you bake to a crisp anything that bothers us on our way out the door. That's the ticket. Now, let's... You hear that? Sounds like those things have regrouped. How about we make them regret it? Come on, darling. Let's make sure these things never bother the wayward again. So fierce, so pleasurable. Wet cave really did a number on it. I'm not going to be much help now. Back at long last. But where's our girl? Did you find Polly? Oh, God. Polly? Whoa. You're not looking so great, darling. Duchess, I'm not feeling great. Friend, why, why don't you sit her down? Um, Jug should do the trick. This is real snug. That's not gonna do at all. Oh, Polly. This is all my fault. Solomon, no. Don't you dare. This is not... Uh, Duchess, tell me you emptied this out. Did I? You know, I'm 80%. Duchess? It's all right. I, I can fix this. There's a robotics shop over in Somersville that... Oh. Oh, oh. Solomon, you're going nowhere. Look, I'm sorry to even ask, but is there any chance you might be able to help us out here? I can make it worth your while. Find Polly this new body. 
I'll tell you everything I know about Crane and his treasure. Please say yes. You are a lifesaver. Here, take this. It's a signal beacon. We just plant that on Polly's new frame, and we'll handle it from there. And here, you'll need this to get into the place. Just leave it unlocked so we can come and get the body later. And make sure it's pristine. No damage, no reprogramming. Factory defaults only. I don't want anything going wrong in the transfer. And at the risk of sounding like a broken record, thank you. We'll all owe you big after this. Oh. Well now, what do we have here? Are you another ghost? I cannot bring you the peace you require, spirit. Leave me be. <sighs> Must we, spirit? Oh, so be it. Welcome to Duncan and Duncan's, Appalachia's premier robotics dealer. I am Skinner. How may I help you, alleged member of the living? Assaultrons are military-grade hardware, my professed liveling. As such, all of our machines have already been spoken for. Outstanding deal with the United States military just waiting for pickup. You understand. I'm sorry. But I simply cannot. The price of such a machine, even before its noted uptick in demand, was in millions of dollars. Bottle caps? Actual trash? Hmm. Then it's likely safe to presume the amount you'd need to offer is in the mid ten figures. Is that so? Mr. Duncan are so very risk-averse. Uh, fine. Here, you may collect it upstairs. <laughs> Fool. By all means. Someday.
Hey, you got one. Signals coming through loud and clear. You know, I don't throw the word hero around a lot. Come over here and let's discuss, huh? Now that's what I like to hear. Seriously, thank you for sticking your neck out for me. It's true. You've worked real hard putting things right for us. None of us are going to forget what you've done. But that really just leaves one last topic for us to discuss. Doesn't it? Crane, you ready to listen? I'm just warning you, I can't guarantee you're going to be happy with what I'm about to say. All right, then. Follow me. So, I've known...